everyone, Tiffany Almazan coming to you live from Dewey, Arizona. It is the end of day one barn hunting and just want to give you a quick update. Our last dog is going for a run right now, just finishing up. So we're running a bit behind today, but check out this view. It's beautiful here. We're at Mortimer Family Farms and hey Michelle. So this is the last stragglers that are still here for barn hunting. So Grace and Sketch are our last dogs running, crazy eight. So Nicholas and Ian got, um, both got cues in see, crazy eights. They had great runs, um, got better as the day went on too. So no cues in senior or master for either of them. Um, but it was interesting for Ian, his first time in seniors, so he's got to figure out he needs to get four rats now. <laughs> but they're both doing really good. Nicholas is, I'm so happy for him. He hasn't been in the ring in a little bit, missed some trials, um, but his paw's doing really good and he was a little bit stressed. So I actually pulled him out of his second master's run, I think it was. Um, Cause I'm like, he's, he's done, he's not, he's stressed. He found, the cool thing was I learned some things. He found the two rats, didn't hold on them long enough, but they were the only things he stopped at in the whole, the whole ring time. So those are the only ones he paused at or even looked at. So I'm like, great. So I need to call it quicker, reward him better. And then he was just starting to get stressed. Wouldn't, didn't want to hunt, um, just kind of wanted out. And I knew he was done. So we just called it. And then I was like, oh, there they are. So that was great. Good experience for me. Good learning. So hey, Trudy. Um, but it's a beautiful day here. So we were supposed to have like 86 degrees. It didn't turn out to being that hot, thankfully. Um, but it was kind of breezy all day. We had some hot moments in the blind, but it's beautiful here. So I don't know, they didn't plant corn in this field. Yeah, I don't know if they're going to this time, but anyway, this is where I am. So I might just do some, uh, I'm gonna truck camp tonight. So we're gonna have fun. So we'll see how it goes. I'm gonna go run out and grab some food shortly. So, hey Valerie. Um, but this is day one. So just wanna give you an update. Ian is getting very close to his uh, Crazy Eights bronze title. So if he has a fantastic run tomorrow in his Crazy Eights run, he might just get his title. But I'm not even telling him that yet because I don't want to pressure him, right? So, <laughs> uh, but anyway, that's my update for today. I'm just spinning around so you can kind of just kind of see the view as the sun is setting. I'm gonna give the dogs a walk and then go out for some food and get ready for some rest and a new day tomorrow. So for all, um, did I miss this saying hi to anybody? I don't know. Oh yes, Michelle, I do love this place too, but I will say that the um, foxtails are going crazy out here. So now that I know what they are, they, they are much drier than they were last time and they were like all over Ian. So I will be going over them with a fine tooth comb that I didn't bring with me tonight to make sure that nothing else gets on them. So anyway, that's my quick update. So great day, a lot of fun, um, a lot of good runs. We got some good cues going on and I don't think I think I may have missed a class, but as far as I'm aware, there was no peeing in the ring for anybody all day. And that is fantastic. I call it good too for, for Nicholas and Ian. I didn't even think about it. It was so awesome. So I will um, update you on day two tomorrow. So that's only a short day. So but we'll see how we do. So have a great night and uh, I'll talk to you tomorrow.